Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how to make music activated lights. So, for this project, you'll need 8 LEDs. I'm going to try and desolder a few of these. 2 TIP31 transistors. I'll put a link in the description of where you can get them. An old 3.5mm headphone jack. I just cut the ends off small headphones. Some wires. And a 12 volt DC wall adapter. These are very common to find. Most small electronics use them. Just look on the front to make sure it says 12 volts. For this project, we're going to be following this schematic. The download link is in the description. I'm not going to go into all the details on how to make it, but basically, four LEDs are controlled by one channel, and the other four are controlled by the other. With the LEDs going off at different times, this makes for a cool effect. Anyway, once you finish the circuit, it should just look like a jumble of wires. But when we plug in the wall adapter, plug the headphone jack into my iPod and turn on the microphone, you can see that when I snap, the LEDs go off. Now, because I only have two LEDs at the moment, I'm using two diodes in place of the other six LEDs, but I recommend using all eight for a better effect. I also decided to take it one step further and hook up an Arduino and some relays. I did videos a while back on both these components, if you want to go check them out. But this basically allowed me to take a much bigger light, or these LED strip lights I got, and hook them up to the TIP31 transistor. So I ran the strip lights around my TV and turned on some music, and here's what I got. I'll put a link in the description of where you can get these lights. They're really cool and really bright, uh, and they look good with the music. So I hope you guys like this video. I might do a follow-up to show how I hooked up the strip lights, but make sure to subscribe and like me on Facebook to be notified when I upload new videos. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.